on the Facebook Live video on the April 10, 2022. At the 1 hour 33 minutes mark. The man of God Trinity Holy, amongst many prophecies that he gave during this live broadcast, he said he saw people with so much money, overnight losing everything. I've seen that vision where I saw people with so much money overnight left nothing. That's where it's heading. But the Lord is going to empower and lift up his own people. How panicked would you be if you had money in the bank and could not get to it all because the bank said your account was closed? That was one woman's ordeal and it went on for months. Bank of America accounts missing. People losing money. One day it's there, next day it's not. Imagine this, you log into your bank account and you find that money is missing. A scary day for some Bank of America customers Wednesday. They checked their accounts and found their money gone. I missed $1,400 from my account and they're telling me that there's no way they can help us. You missing money too? There you go. It was a nationwide issue. I get a text alert and it says my account is overdrawn. One customer tweeted their balance of negative $2,000. Well, you may have noticed it lately, many banks closing branches as more customers bank online and fewer go into the bank in person. But for one East Bay man, it caused a mild panic, actually. The Bank of America shut down his branch just hours after he made a huge deposit and his money disappeared. So you can imagine how worried he was. Yeah, it's hard to believe this story happened at a major bank. Yeah, true. Uh, this viewer deposited $33,000 through a teller at a Bank of America in Oakland. And hours later, the branch shut down. His deposit never got posted and everybody kept telling him, sorry, there's nothing we can do. And I said, you're telling me that Bank of America lost $33,000 of my money and you're telling me right here to my face, there's nothing you can do. That's right, sir. It was like a bad dream, except it was real. Let your investments be in Christ Jesus, then you will surely stand on solid ground. We take heed of all prophetic words that are spoken, that we may learn to pray accordingly, and we take comfort that God still speaks to us today, and his plans for us are always for our good.